hello everyone and uh, welcome to mission hub in this video i will try to answer some of your question in the comment section let's start with uh, the first question my value is coming in points for example from 0 to 10 it's going uh, 0 comma 0 etc let's start a new composition and i will add my text here or any text now right click here effect and uh, effect control slider control i will then open the text layer and open the slider controller now with alt key press click on the uh, source text and then we will pick the slider so now if we animate the uh, slider let's say here is zero and here 99 if you run preview this you will get this problem and uh, how to solve this one you need just to write uh, m capital math dot round and open parenthesis and you need to close it here so now you will get the number uh, fixed like this let's move to the next question is uh, hi there need your help guidance want to draw animated line that is controlled by two nulls on both ends with a beam effect can't sort out the solution etc i got your point so to do this is uh, easy i will right click new composition and uh, hit ok uh, actually there is uh, two way to do that first one is to click on the pen tool and i will draw a line i will add a stroke and then you need to open the uh, shape and select the path this one and then go to window create nulls from path and click on the uh, point follow nulls it will create for you two nulls and uh, if you move this one it will move if i hit p and the keyboard i will add a wiggle effect with um, one two hundred and then same thing here wiggle one three hundred now you will get uh, this moving uh, line uh, next option is to new composition i will add a background new solids hit ok and from effect and preset i will uh, add the beam effect and uh, which will give us um, the starting point and the ending point now i will right click here add a uh, new null object i will name this start and again new null and I will name this one and now let's open the uh, select the start and the end and hit p in the keyboard to reveal the position and then in the effect controls uh, with alt key pressed click on the starting point and then the, you pick the starting position now let's uh, do the same thing with the ending point and i will pick the ending point i will pick the uh, end position and uh, if we move the end position here the starting position here it will do the same thing next one is when I do the zoom it won't zoom into uh, through the world the lettering stay the same and uh, this, this is for the flying text uh, tutorial so uh, just one thing you have to uh, be sure here is my text and uh, be sure when you open the text uh, when you add the animate to enable the pre character 3d and uh, if you don't uh, enable this option you won't get the letter in the 3d uh, access okay and uh, then how to save it as a video after select the composition uh, add to media encoder queue or add to render queue the easiest way is to add to media encoder queue you will get this uh, this window uh, from here you can choose the uh, h264 which is the famous uh, the famous um, file type and from here you can choose uh, like 
any um, setting like YouTube or Vimeo or uh, iPhone, iPad, whatever, or you just click match source for the highest uh, version. And here you can choose the um, file uh, name where to save it. And then you just click on the start queue, the green line, and you will get uh, your video. Next question is how can I center the text? Um, select any text. Let's see. And then go to uh, paragraph here and uh, click on the center text. Or you can find it here window paragraph. Next question I can't access the expression source text no matter how many times I click source text. You need to keep pressing the Alt key. Uh, button and the keyboard and then click on the uh, stopwatch to reveal the expression and uh, last question how can I write uh, text more than one line four to five line uh, and this is a uh, typewriter text effect let's take this one new composition I will do it first so this is my text and left aligned and here I will add um, new adjustment layer. I will add some um, expression, some slider three. And um, here, and uh, now with Alt key pressed, I will click on the source text and uh, Control V to add the expression. And for this, we need to add some reference. So we need to add time equal. And I will pick the first one. I will write this one time and then speed and then start at. So I will add another variable uh, speed equal and then we pick the speed last one is uh, start at and uh, again I will pick the value from there now it's uh, working, but we need to add some uh, values. So time zero, speed five, and start at zero. And we have our text. So uh, if you want to add a more than line, what you have to do, so I will uh, rename this comp6 to text one, and I will drag it to a new composition okay now the text one i will duplicate it and again add it to the same composition and add it here like three times i will add another one and just here now you have three lines all you need to do is to move them in the timeline like this this way like this we have um three option okay or uh, three lines i hope this was uh, helpful for you please if you have any comments or if you want to learn uh, more about after effects or adobe premiere pro or any software let me know in the comment and i will try to uh, help you as much as i can thank you so much for watching and uh, stay safe see you